everyone and welcome to Shipshape. Uh, for those of you who are new to Shipshape, uh, what it is is uh, getting into shape mentally, physically, emotionally and spiritually uh, through different tools, techniques and products I've come along the way in my own life to help uh, enhance, enhance each of our lives. It's also just a bit of a, an idea on uh, what it's like to work on a logging ship from New Zealand to China because uh, that's what I'm doing for a job at the moment so I thought I'd you know might as well share that with you with uh, with you guys so today I wanted to talk about something uh, that I've been thinking about and that's embracing the process so you know when we when you think about an outcome a desired outcome and you're just focused on that outcome and obviously with the desired outcome comes a process to achieve that desired outcome so for example say you wanted to lose 10 kilos of weight right so uh, you need to you need to work out, you need to schedule workouts in, you also need to eat well, as well as just spend some time focusing on, uh, you know, the end result as well. So, uh, you know, when you're just focused on the desired outcome, the process itself can be quite boring and dull and just like, it just has to be done. But when you come, as Eric, Tom, as Eric Thomas uh, sort of says, when you come kind of a standpoint of you get to do it rather than you have to do it then you know it's a whole new ball game and when you start to embrace and enjoy the process as well as the desired outcome then uh, you know it's it's, a, it's just a game changer you know I mean really you're gonna have to go through that process anyway so why not focus and think about enjoying it so say for example you've uh, you you know we'll go back to that example of losing 10 kilos so you decided you need to work out five times a week. Uh, you know you've sussed out your nutrition. You've uh, eliminated certain foods that you were eating before that weren't so great for you, and you've also included foods and maybe some supplements into your uh, now diet that uh, you know are going to help with your goals. So um, you know Tony Robbins calls it you know to help with the process to calls it scoring. So. Like you know when you're um, watching a movie and, the, and there's scoring, there's music, so you've just got to think of ideas to help that process, um, to help you enjoy that process a lot more. So say for example you're working out, you know working out is a lot different to, um, you know it's a lot different working out to your favourite workout music uh, as an example uh, than just to listen to no music. So you know it's all about just finding creative ways to enjoy the process a lot more so you can actually continue with the process so when it gets hard, when it gets boring, you'll, you'll still do it because consistency is the only way to get results guys and you know when you really fully understand the power of consistency, you know there's always this little, well that for me, for me personally there was this little nagging thing in my mind where even though I wasn't being consistent, it sort of seemed like it was easy to be consistent even though I wasn't being consistent if that makes sense so now when I fully understand the power of consistency and realize that that's really one of the main main things then you know it's easy to be consistent when you understand the power of it you know it's way more powerful to work out Monday to Friday every day 20 minutes a day than you know to go all out and work one hour on Monday and then not work out again for the next two weeks and I have been so guilty of that guys I've been so guilty of not being consistent I've been so guilty of procrastination especially here on these ships I mean I'm never ever going to have so much time in my life that I have with these ships I mean I work about two hours a day uh, you know try to sleep you know eight hours or whatever so then I've got around about at least 15 hours a day to myself you know so, you know, with that time, I can do so much, and it's taken me eight trips to really fully realize that, and to really fully implement that, and to really, really take advantage of this time. So, when you start enjoying the process, when you start to really start, you know, excited, you know, being excited to work out, and, you know, a lot of times when you're after that desired outcome, you know, you don't there's no way you sort of enjoy the process, you cringe it, but the more you do it, that the more 
you enjoy it, the more it becomes a habit and the more it becomes ingrained in you and the more the more you do it, the more you it's like you get to a point where you feel you feel strange and you feel uncomfortable not doing it. You know, just as much uh, so as before when you felt uncomfortable for doing it because you obviously had that ingrained of, of not doing it, if that makes sense. So just embrace the process guys, like enjoy the process because it's not all about the outcome. I mean once you reach that outcome you're going to have to shift to another outcome which is going to require a whole new series of processes. So you know, life is all about the journey and in that journey are all the processes and all the maintenance that goes on with uh, your desired outcomes. I mean no one gets fit, strong and healthy through uh, not working out and not eating well and not doing certain things that, re that are required to, to get that way. So, you know, you might as well enjoy the process and just really understand and see the process for what it is. You know, like, once you really just fully get this and really grasp this, it's, a, it's an absolute game changer, guys. So, that's just my two cents today. Um, I'm just sitting here in the ship it's about 13th day feels like i've been on here forever just like every other ship but you know it's good like with the with these ships it's like a mini little crucible every ship and you know i can transform myself every time i go on these voyages you know I, every ship for me every ship is the chance of it's like a new year's eve you know with new year's eve you get you have resolutions you, you want transformations happen in your life for me, each ship is like that. It's a chance to to work on myself and to have different resolutions that I can achieve. So, um, so yeah, the main point, the main two cents today, guys, is just embrace the process, enjoy it, find a way to uh, you know make it more exciting, make it more enjoyable for yourself, like listen to music for workout, for example, and um, just realize that it's not all about the outcome, the process can be just as enjoyable as the outcome once you really really start to grasp this and really start to really just have a different mind shift then it's an absolute game changer so just thought I'd share that with you today guys hopefully uh, that makes sense and it helps somebody it has helped me to really think about the process and to embrace it rather than just think oh no I need to you know I want to be strong I want to be fit but you know, I've got to do this handful of pull-ups and push-ups and things like that. Uh, can't be bothered. But you know, once you get to the point where you actually start enjoying that, and like I said, create creative ways to to improve that experience, then like I said, it's an absolute game changer. So thanks for tuning in, and uh, I look forward to bringing you some more material soon. And uh, much love.